Oh, I can't believe this. Just when I think I'm almost done, they dump even more work on me. Huh? What? Oh. Hi, sweetie. Yeah, still working. <sighs> no, it's nothing serious. Just more god-awful busy work for me to do for some reason. Hmm? It's time for dinner. <sighs> yeah, I guess I didn't realize how late it had gotten. Sorry. But I still have a lot of work to do. You can eat without me. What? I must be hungry. What do you mean? Yeah, I guess I did miss lunch. Well, it's fine. I wasn't hungry at the time anyway. Sweetie, I love you, but I have got a lot of work to get done. I'll come down to eat later when I'm done. Baby, I'm, I'm telling you, it's fine. I'll just get something later. Eating by yourself won't kill you. Baby, I, I told you, I can't come down to eat right now because I can't, okay? Because I don't have the time, all right? Sorry if I can't accommodate every little wish that you have. But unlike you, I actually have some serious work. Sweetie, did you... Did, did you just flinch? No, no, it, it wasn't nothing. You, you flinched just now, didn't you? Now, baby, wait, hold on. I'm, I'm sorry, okay? I shouldn't have yelled like that. Hey, come here. No, I won't do anything. I, I swear, just come here. Let me hold you, okay? Hmm. God, look at you. Your whole body is shaking. What? Why are you apologizing? What? No. No, I wasn't mad at you, I swear. And you weren't annoying me either, I just... I was just frustrated with all the work I suddenly got. I'm sorry. Sweetie, is there... something you're not telling me? Sorry, it's just... That reaction, it was like you were expecting something. Shh, 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 it's okay. You don't have to tell me anything right now. For now, let's just go and sit down. I'll even get you something to drink, okay? All right, good. And come on, let's go rest in the living room for now. Here, I bought you some soda to drink. I know you prefer that to the wine we have. So, sweetie, do you think you're ready to talk about it now? Again, I won't force you or anything, but it does seem like something we should talk about. Hmm? Do I remember your last boyfriend? Well, kind of. I mean, you only mentioned him, like, once. You wanted to forget about him. Why? Because he what? He, he hit you? Are you serious? Wait, is that how you got that scar? You told me it was because you fell. Of course I'm upset. Sorry. Sorry. I, I don't mean to shout, but sweetie, he hurt you for God's sake. 
Why did you ever stay with a guy like him? What? You were scared. Scared of what? Him hurting you. You could have just gone to someone for help, you know, the the cops, family, somebody. You were scared of being alone. Baby, what are you talking about? He he yelled at you too. What what about? He called you ugly and worth oh, that son of a he, he made you feel inadequate, didn't he? Made you think no one else would want you. Then, then what happened? I mean, I'm glad you clearly got away from him, but if you were so afraid to be alone, what happened? <sighs> ah, how am I not surprised that asshole cheated, that miserable... Sweetie, I'm so sorry. I had no idea. Why didn't you tell me any of this? Yeah, I know you wanted to forget about him, but if you were this stressed and sensitive to yelling, why didn't you tell me? What? You were worried I'd find it annoying and snap. Baby, why would you think that? Because that's how he reacted, isn't it? That was why you flinched back there, wasn't it? Because you're worried I'd hurt you or get mad enough to leave. No, no, it's not okay, baby. I'm sorry I scared you like that. But you need to talk to me about this. Because keeping all this bottled up isn't good for you. And I want you to be able to tell me stuff like this. Especially when you're feeling scared or troubled. I love you, sweetheart. And I always will. So no matter what kind of scars or burdens you have, I want you to tell me about them. Because I want to be the shoulder you can cry on, okay? Come here. It's okay. Let it all out. You cry as much as you need to. When you're done, we can go eat that dinner you made. Bah, forget about my work. You can wait. Being here with my precious and beautiful girlfriend is far more important than any kind of paperwork. Besides, I'm more interested in hearing what you made. Mind filling me in? (sighs) Sounds amazing. Can't go wrong with something as classic as chicken, right? (laughs) Oh, there's that beautiful smile. Sweetie. I'm still so sorry about yelling at you like that. I promise I'll make it up to you. And whenever you feel like talking to me, no matter what it's about, just tell me, okay? And I promise to listen. Oh, there is something you want to say. Go ahead. What is it? (laughs) You want to get ice cream after dinner. Yeah. Sounds nice. It'll be my treat. Well, if everything's all settled, then how about we go and get ourselves some of that amazing food you made? Because I don't know about you, but I'm starving. (laughs) 